So what are some of the obvious and not so obvious benefits of employee engagement? Things like strategy, design, marketing, distribution, operational effectiveness can all be easily copied by your competitors. But an engaged workforce, that is not something that can be copied. But how do you get an engaged workforce? So all the studies show engaged workers produce much more than non-engaged workers. That's an obvious thing. You don't need research. We know instinctively if people are more engaged, there's going to be higher productivity, greater loyalty, better perfection about everything. The key point to getting engaged employees, we found, is the interaction with the managers and the communication points. And if these things are working well, then we start to get the results. So if you want sustained corporate value, if you want to get the ROI, you know, return on investment, then engaged employees are absolutely critical to that. And you've got to look in your company and say, are we getting enough engagement? The scores are very low. I mean, in Japan, the average is under 30%. And that actually corresponds with the West too. It's usually engaged employees are under uh, 30%. So it means huge numbers are disengaged or not, not particularly engaged.